Hi, this is Brandon from Taytalk Tech here, uh, back with another video. Uh, today I want to go ahead and cover fractional scaling in Linux Mint 20. Uh, I recently changed my the operating system on my personal laptop from my go-to Pop! OS to Linux Mint 20, primarily due to this fractional scaling. Now, right now I'm on my Pop! OS desktop. Now, Pop! OS, you know, it's pretty simple to kind of get to the display settings. You're just going to you're going to right-click and hit display. Now. One of the things that you will notice here is when it talks about scaling, I have 100% or 200%. And this is the problem that I was running into um, on my laptop. Now, of course, you can go ahead and change the resolution, but then, you know, that's going to impact the quality of, you know, things like video and, and stuff like that. And, you know, I just want to, I want things simple. I don't want to mess with them. Um, so I want something that's going to be a little bit simpler. So that's kind of why I switched it over to... Um, Linux Mint. Now it is something that they are working on with um, with Pop! OS from System76, so I'm sure that's something that will be implemented in the future. I don't know if it'll be in a future release or a future update or what the status of that is. I just know that it's something that is not available currently and I just really prefer the you know, the the way that it looks when you have a um, fractional scaling versus, you know, just changing the resolution. You get much more proportional uh, uh, changes in, in viewing uh, when you do it that way. So um, it's pretty simple. Um, there was a couple. I when I honestly when I first did it, I was kind of confused and I had no idea. And honestly, I was kind of lazy about going and reading the documentation. Um, so I did end up eventually finding uh, a solution to go ahead and getting the uh, fractional scaling working. Working. Now we're going to go ahead and here and go into display. I'm just going to search it like that, and here's our display settings. I'm, I'm running it currently in a virtual machine, as you can see. Now, um, if you notice here, it's all grayed out. You know, and when I first came in here, I was like, what in the world's going on? Um, you know, so that's, you know, I, this is, I don't have a lot of experience with Linux Mint. I've used it in the past, you know, mostly just for playing around and stuff like that, as I was experimenting with distributions. Well, I went ahead into one of the forums and I was able to find somebody who was kind enough to explain what needed to be done and it's pretty simple. All you gotta do is go down here to user interface scale and right now it's at automatic and it even says here it says this is global scaling factor for all monitors in automatic mode. It is chosen based on the primary monitor. Now we gotta change that from automatic 1x to normal. Now you'll see that now you saw a little bit of light there out of it. Now what you just gotta do is go over here, hit this and then change your scaling. We can just do, we'll just do this just for testing purposes and now see, boom. Um, so that's it, that's actually it. If you like the, if you like, and then I'm sorry, uh, go ahead and um, hit keep configuration if you want to keep it, revert if you don't want to keep it. Um, but yeah, that, that's it, pretty simple. So um, thank you very much for watching this video. If you like the content, go ahead and hit the like button. If you didn't like it, go ahead and thumbs down. Uh, subscribe if you like the content that I'm making. Uh, thank you and have a great day.